Hey guys, how are you doing? It's Crystal. I got a really interesting question recently from somebody who asked why it was that earthbound spirits tended to be attracted to human beings um, or even to attach onto human beings. This is a good question. Um, before I answer it, I want you to know that an earthbound spirit or entity is, an, is a human being who is alive on the earth, who has passed away and who has not crossed into the light. When we cross into the light, we truly transform. We take on our new heavenly light body. We are opened up. We are running high, high vibration. We're extremely connected to source energy. An earthbound entity, in contrast, has never had that experience. They've simply died, and now they're hanging out in the astral level, that interbetween astral level that is close or proximate to the earth energy or to the earth plane. Why would an entity choose to hang out in that level as opposed to crossing into the light? And then why would they be attracted to us? Well, the answer is an entity would choose to stay in that astral level if they were confused or disoriented. For example, if they suffered a traumatic death and they don't understand what's happening to them, or an entity would choose to hang out in that astral level if they didn't want to pass into the light because perhaps they feared judgment or recrimination or they simply preferred the energy of Earth. Both of those types of entities, the confused or those that are choosing not to go into the light, are not the types of entities we really want to contact or attempt to communicate with us. They're just people who are dead. And just like in life, we choose very carefully those people and personalities we want to spend time with. We have to be discriminating with the spirits with whom we interact on the other side because we don't want to be spending our time on unenlightened spirits, which most earthbound entities are. So now why would they be attracted to us? Why would they be attracted to human beings? It's because of our energy. They literally want to use our energy as a power source for them. But it's the quality of the energy at issue. An earthbound spirit is going to be attracted to negative energy, to lower vibration energy. For example, that energy that we emit when we're very angry or we are just typically negative when we're fearful, when we're anxious, perhaps when we're intoxicated or altered not for a spiritual reason, that type of energy emits a very specific signal which is attractive to those lower level earthbound entities who want to simply attach to us in a parasitical fashion and use that energy because they prefer the quality of it or because it's literally powering them up. It is fueling their light or, if you will, their dark body. It's allowing them to continue their experience in the way that they want to. But at the same time, it's draining you of your energy and it's changing your experience. So we don't want earthbound entities or really any entities to be attached to us, to be draining us, to be in our field too closely. And the way we can make sure that that doesn't happen is to always be very mindful of the type of vibration we're holding in our body and in our space. I'm a huge advocate of high vibration living, which involves very intentionally putting ourselves in high vibration experiences so that our own baseline signature can rise. And it's when that baseline signature is elevated and ascended and very connected to source energy that we are emitting a signal that is literally repellent and truly antagonistic to earthbound entities and all negative and lower entities, not just earthbounds, all of them. They can't withstand it, they don't understand it, and they don't want to be near it. So if you're having an issue with an earthbound spirit or any kind of spirit in your space and you don't want it around, first of all, clear all the negativity out of you. Do not be afraid, do not be anxious. Get in connection with source energy and begin to run those higher vibrations because that will break the connection and get rid of the parasitical earthbound entity.